what what happened with Chris? What was going through your mind? You know Chris. So so, so people don't understand. <laughs> I know I know Chris. Right. I know Chris. So people yeah. don't understand. People don't understand. Me and Chris, this the, what we have has been going on since I was in high school. And, and uh, see, a lot of people don't know the backstory, but me and Chris, we clearly understand the backstory. So, like, I got invited to a LeBron James camp, you know, the big Nike LeBron James camp when he was in college. Ironically, my roommate at the time, Stephen Kirk. And people don't know a lot about that. Me and him, every basketball camp, USA team, he's my roommate. Every every single time since we were younger. Six story there. So, you know, you, you're on a certain team and you get a chance to play against LeBron. I think OJ Mayo was there and Chris Paul was there. I killed them, destroyed them. I'm talking about in front of every fucking NBA scout out there. I'm just a sophomore in, in, in fucking college. I'm going at them every fucking play. I'm calling them a child. And then I see them in the NBA. So, of course, the energy is going to roll over to the NBA, you know. And he does, you know, Chris, he does slick shit. Like, you know, people don't know. That's a little dirty motherfucker, man. Chris <laughs> know that too, man. You know, I know you didn't want to say it, but I said it for you, though. I know that was your teammate. <laughs> Like, and, and I love CP, bro. I love what he brings to the game. I love, like, like he changed the game also. So, like, you have to give him all his props. But, like, he knows how to finesse the system, too. Like, and, and you got to give him credit for that, too. So, you know, it was just one of those one of those ones I just had to get off my chest. And I called him right out. <laughs> I called him right out the two. I, the same night. I, I, I do know Chris, and I love Chris. And I also, for a long period of time in my life, hated Chris. And Chris, <laughs> and Chris, Chris knows this. And <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> It's fine. We've moved past that. We've moved past that. Was there something he did, though? Like, was that just an act of rage or was there, there something that sort of just or an act of frustration? Was there something that sort of set you off that you would shove him like that? No, it was just frustration, you know, added on to like, you know, you go and, you know, the refs aren't going to foul out Chris Paul. You go for a layup. He pulls you to the side. You fall on your side. I don't know. You miss layup real bad. It looks like you're trash. But the whole time, like. Ref, he's just literally yanking you out the air, like you know, like you guys didn't see that, but okay, you know, you shoot a jump shot floater, he he elbows you in the hip or some shit like that, and you know, you push him, he oh whoa whoa, whoa. You, you know, Chris man, man, so uh, but he does a job real well, so you gotta respect it, man, you got to, you got to, I love his game.